dare I say, sir, Vinland Saga episode 14. I'm listening. Mm. 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 I'll tell you. <laughs> I got excited because it picked up right where we left off. Yep. And um, the music, my God. I picked that up. Okay. But when we open up with, and Gardar's right there trying to get Arnhide up on the back of the horse because we're like, we're still processing that he is her husband. Yeah. Because we're like, a and right there and who's this guy? And then you start hearing Snake. I'm like, we're going to. We're going to see some snake action. And that fight scene between them two. Now, Garter's going to sit down now. Too. Like, you felt the speed mm-hmm. of how fast his attacks were. And he's like, Whoo. Yeah. Whoo. And I'm like, oh. If he wasn't injured to where snake could easily, like, uh, hit him in his wound and then bring him down, that would have been a very good fight. Snake didn't want to kill him. I don't know. That would have been a good fight. I, don't, I think if, if snake was, they were going for kill for kill, snake had him hands down. You think so? He wanted him alive. He reacted to a couple of his swings in a way well, that yes. went, like, he was surprised. He was they were like, fast, and he was okay. a fighter or the had some ability. The same way he reacted when Thorfinn was doing his thing. Oh, yeah, but, and then, like, oh, you guys just stand back there and do nothing. Yeah. It's fine. And I loved, best part of this episode, we got a glimpse of the past. You know me. I'm a sucker for the past. <laughs> I thought you were going to say it was slow. I'm happy. Fine. No, because okay. it was a good break because the beginning was so fast yeah. and so much. And the, there was just, this is just the tip of the iceberg. We're still dealing with while they've been gone. We're still dealing with... They're on the way over right now, Canute and his army, with the Vikings. And you learned a little bit... Well, first off, that whore that A&R is trying to be with (laughs) is pregnant. I told you she was the same girl we saw in the beginning. Immediately when she said she was pregnant with with, uh, Kittle's child, I was like, yeah, that was the one in the back of the cart, and that was the one he had his head in his lap in. I proved it was was a different girl. No, ma'am. She's pregnant now. (laughs) There's, there, they, that's her, it, she is his favorite and now pregnant. That scene with the other girl where you think it was the same uh, Arnhide, that was with Omar. They were trying to get pregnant with Omar so oh, that right. way they could come into the family. Right. They, those the were The one in the women. cart, though, that was dragging in, the one that was know. in the bed and Kittle was crying when he had a sensitive episode. He had his head in, a, in a, her lap and it was Arnhide because she's the favorite. So she has a lot of plates spinning. I'm sure she has a lot because husband's back. Eonor's chomping at the bit, and she's pregnant with by the the the, the, the master's and like, kid. Imagine your kid being pulled away from you like that, and you're just like, yeah, yeah. you're just a slave somewhere now. Maybe. No wonder she walked around with this like monotone kind of like just like every day is the same. Obviously, as a slave, right. but. Uh, with her, it was even more paramount. You could tell she had like, like a lot of uh, emotions pent up and like sorrow and yeah. rage. But her best, her method of dealing with it was just to let it pass just and deal hope with you don't it. get blown away. Yep. And I like the interaction with her and the old master. Oh, yeah. He was great. Like, yeah. just because they're all treating him like he's like senile and old, but he's not. He's just physically not capable. And he's there. And, and you saw a little bit of like his past and, and uh, Kittle's past and. It's just so you, much in that episode. And I, you saw that by the end of his speech, he was telling her to go after, to to go to him because you were too late when you decided yeah. to go. Yeah, he he said something along the lines of, "Even if you weather the storm, it still leaves you with scars." Yeah. So choose your scars. It was basically. It, this is episode two of uh, season two. <laughs> it was I'm great. I'm not mad at you. I'm not mad. <laughs> I'm not mad. It was. This, I can't wait. This is Vinland Saga that I liked in oh, season God. one. <laughs> This is like, all right, we're getting fighting, and you know what? Well, sir, I it was a pleasure arguing yeah, with you for all those weeks because I don't think that yeah. you're going to think there's a bad episode the rest of the way. We have a we have a lot of story to tell and a little yeah. bit of episodes, and you know what? Thorfinn can go knit a blanket, he can go quilt, <laughs> he can go plant. I don't need him. You saw him struggling in this episode. No, there were saw, a couple a shots com, where it was like A and R down. That's what I no, saw no, struggling. No, no, no. There were some shots when Arnheide was explaining her story. When he realized that the Vikings were the ones that probably did Because he was like, oh, it could have and... been me. It could have been me. <laughs> and he's sitting there crying about it. Something he didn't even do. I'm he's glad just... he stopped Anar, though. That was the right decision. He would have yeah. died. Uh, yes. Okay. Snake would have been like, well, you were a good slave. And then... Yeah. Because he, like, they're still slaves. They're still barely yep. accepted. They will be free. Not really. But when the master gets back, when Kittle gets back, but old master earned them the respect. Snake doesn't really care. Because he was getting his horses. Yeah. Aren't how you stay here or you'll He's die a too. He's too, though. He is, but he yeah. was a slasher, and yeah. I know it. If she uh, would have jumped up on that horse. It's going to get to the point where I'm like, are they going to fit everything I know like in this season? They better. Because there's a lot to happen now, and I feel like 
every week that goes by, I'm like, my God, we only have like X amount of. That episodes. was a big chunk, though. The last two episodes yeah. have been big chunks of stories. Doesn't that... it feel like it's a, it is picking up the pace too? I'm not even saying that to like joke. No, like, I was it about to say It does feel thing. like the the pace is now like okay, we've set the premise, all the new characters are introduced, yeah, and now go. Yeah, so here's like like if we say this is season, this is the start of season two. It's literally some somebody came, picked it up, and whipped it across the field. And that's how fast it picked up because Good, we're watching two it. totally different shows. Thank God. I wasted precious time, valuable All time. Right, go. We can go back to like uh, and now enjoying enjoy. Vinland Saga together. I'm, I am enjoying this. This episode was good. All right. <laughs> well, as always, like, comment, and subscribe if you like what we're doing around here, guys. And we will see you next week for episode 15.